Hey guys, Helen Hart Smith here again from the Heart of the Witch's Path YouTube channel. Hope you're having an awesome day. Not doing too bad here. <laughs> so today I wanted to film another uh, walkthrough, basically, of one of my decks. And I wanted to cover one of my tarot decks because it's like one of my favorite uh, artists. And so I've already shared uh, her tarot deck. And so I've talked about the Oracle deck that she's done. And so today's the day we're going to share it. Okay. So the artist is, um, Megan Weber, Megan Weber, also known as Zaharo, I believe is how it's pronounced. She is an art witch and she is fantastic. I know I've done a video. I've talked about her multiple times. I've done a video on her tarot deck, as I've already said, and I've already done a video where I talk about the art pieces, the prints that I have in my collection. Well, kind of the Rumi's collection too, because it was mine and hers. So this is her Oracle deck. So this is the Azucar Bone Oracle deck. Um, Azucar, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Azucar is Spanish for sugar. And so this deck is really beautiful. The Animalis Os Fortuna Tarot deck it, um, is her tarot. And that one is all black and white. This one has color and it's beautiful. So I does it say on the back here? I forgot to count how many cards there are in this deck, but as you can tell from the box, it's not very thick, so there's not a ton of cards in there. Um, so let's explore, shall we? Oh my gosh, are you ready? I'm so excited to share this deck with you. So here we have um, the lid for the little box. This is the, the Azucar Bone Oracle deck by Megan Weber, AKA Zaharo. Um, so this deck is actually um, kind of broken into three sections. So, um, I will kind of share a little bit more about that as we move through. The first section of the deck deals with the wheel of the year, okay? So of course, here we have first up the beautiful Imbolc card. Now you will see um, uh, common themes for Megan is bones, is... Uh, animal bones specifically. Um, and this one is so beautiful because of the color. Um, it's such a, a departure from her tarot deck um, that I, I just love. I love both of them so much. So here we have the Imbolc card. Let's just get through them. Let's just move through them so you can see them. Here we have Astara. And it's neat because she tells you the skull that she's using. So here we have the rabbit. Beltane is goat. Litha is ox. Lamas is dog. I like how you can read the uh, the words up in up in the border too. Maban is duck. Sawen is cat. Love that. She included Dia de los Muertos in this deck um, with a human skull. Totally makes sense. Sugar skull. Um, we have Yule with a squirrel. Hope you can see these okay. Now we move into the next phase and she calls these focus cards. So we start off with clarity. Again, we can read the words in the border here. Hope you can see that okay. Uh, compass. Fog. I love how the fog is green. Isn't that great? Gift. Growth. Meditation. 
mirror and you'll see that we are missing skulls in this section. Um, and so uh, with mirror that completes the focus section and this brings us into the final section which is animal messenger cards and you're going to be back to seeing skulls again. So here we have balance and the horse, courage and lion, embrace and dolphin, feminine deer, Life with an egg, love that. We have masculine with a stag, beautiful stag. We have messenger with a fox skull. Moon with a lunar moth. Muerta with a crow. Omen with a snake. And I love how we get the, the rest of the skeleton in that as well. Rebirth with a phoenix skull. Sun with a monarch butterfly. And that completes the deck. So um, she has, as with her tarot card deck, there is a small book that comes with, I was hoping to get some more... <laughs> more of them visible here. Let's actually kind of pull them out a bit. A little randomness there. So there is a nice little uh, book that comes with the deck. There's no uh, there's no uh, layouts that are part of the deck. So she really kind of leaves it up to you to figure out how you want to work with them. Um, I've done basically the three card like past, present, um, past, present, future layouts. And I've also done this as a uh, pull a card a day. Um, so if I'm, you know, wanting to think about something or if I have a question for the day, pulling one of these and, um, and see where that takes me. So this is the deck. Um, I highly recommend this deck. It is, it's really beautiful. If for nothing else than the artwork. <laughs> so, um, so there is the um, Azucar Bone Oracle deck by Megan Weber, aka Zaharo. I'll put a link in the description box. So if you're interested in purchasing this particular deck, you can go to her website and purchase it. Um, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, uh, want to see more like it, um, or learn something from it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button. We love to have you back here at the channel checking out what's going on. And uh, yeah. That's going to be it for today. Check out the description box also for links to social media and all that good stuff. Do you have this deck? Are you interested in this deck? Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments section. Thanks for taking the time to walk the path for a little while with me. Until next time, blessed be.